Hello everyone, you've got Woodsong here, uh, ready to start off a new, a new week with a new reading. I hope you had a great weekend. Mine was really, really good. Uh, I was very excited. My Our blues band played our first real gig uh, Saturday night, and had, we had a great time doing it. Had a crowd of about 400 people, and uh, played a lot of uh, blues and classic rock, and, and even a little bit of country every now and then. If you'd like to see what we look like, I unfortunately don't have any audio recordings, but if you go to vinnieandthevagrants.com, V-I-N-N-I-E, and the vagrants, all one, one big word, dot com. Uh, and go to the photo gallery and you'll see what we look like up there. I'm the guy on the left with the uh, the short guy, black shirt. I think most of us had black shirts on, though. Uh, playing a purple guitar and a white mandolin at times. So, anyway, uh, that's enough for me. Let's go ahead and, and jump into what's coming up in the upcoming week for you. So, again, we're pulling three cards. We're starting off with, uh, you know, just something to think about. And let's take a look at this. Oh, okay. So the Nine of Swords, this, you know, it suggests what it looks like. We have somebody here who's having a rough night. They can't sleep. They're worrying about things. So this suggests, you know what, if when you have things on your mind that are bothering you, how, how do you address that? How do you deal with it? What should you do? Okay, and let's take a look and see what, what should we do. Okay, what we need to do is, is, I know this is easy to say, it's not easy to do. You need to leave it behind. You need to change directions. This, the Eight of Cups is someone who has turned his back on what he has achieved in the past. Now, he's not saying, you know, it was bad in the past or I didn't like it. He's saying, you know what, I think it'll be better if I do this instead. So this is what we need to do. If you have troubling issues, you just need to say, okay, fine. They, they, they were there. They troubled me. It's over. I'm building a wall and I'm moving forward. That's what we want to be able to do. What, what will we find as we try to do that? And we have the Seven of Wands. Now, here, you know, here we come into the thing where I said, you know, it's easy to say, move ahead, but it's not always easy to do. As we move ahead, we may find things uh, uh, distracting us, working against us, uh, uh, just, just contrasting us, competing with us as we try to move. So we've got to bait that off. We've got to fight that off. We've got to hold that off. Now, the thing about the Seven of Wands is, well, that, that sounds like a, a troubling thing to have to do. I don't know if you can see the face on this person. He is not bothered by this contention. This is fine. He's having a ball. This just makes him stronger. This makes him happier. Okay, so I'm not saying go out and seek seek uh, you know uh, difficulties or competition or fights or anything like that. I'm saying don't let it wear you down. Okay, that's just life. Life always puts little obstacles in our way. And we always have to try to cope with it. Sometimes they're not so little. We still have to try to cope with it. Okay, do so. Just just don't let it don't let it overwhelm you. Okay. So I guess in summary, we're having, you know, when we're saying when you do have difficulties that are bothering you, you need to turn your back on them. You know, acknowledge them. You earned them. You own them. That's fine. Take them, you know, uh, uh, recognize what they are, put them in a box, seal it shut, set it aside. Move forward. Turn your back on it. Move forward to something more fun, more exciting. In the process of doing something new, you may find new obstacles in your way. Don't sweat it. That's just life. That's what happens. You, you, you're you able to handle that. Move forward. Don't let it stop you. That's kind of what we have for the beginning of the week here. You know, I hope you have a great week. Um, it, it started off pretty busy for me already uh, this morning. Um, and I guess that's about it. This is Woodsong. I am uh, out, and I hope you have a wonderful week. Take care. Bye-bye.